Well, this is the Olympic torch relay coming through Rutherglen. Part of the celebrations as the torch relay goes around Scotland. The whole kind of part of today and the reason behind today is to get as many young people involved uh, in sport and physical activity and give them a chance to say that on the day when the torch came through Rutherglen that they played a part uh, in, in what it's all about. The idea here is really just that we could have had people standing passively on the side. Uh, what we're very much about in South Lanarkshire is actually about getting young people actually physically involved and uh, closing the main street, getting the cars off it, uh, turning uh, the main street into many arenas where there's opportunities to get involved is, uh, is, is been great for, uh, for all the young people who are here. My name is Scott Frew. I'm currently training for the GB handball team. It's fantastic. I mean, you can tell even the, the rain isn't kind of dampening spirits. Um, for me, it's all about kind of leaving this legacy, and that's what London 2012 is all about. Um, today, even though I'm not from the area, it's, I'm, I'm really keen on you know promoting the sport and promoting kids in sport. And I think this has been a well-run event that made it easy for me to just come in and, and be part of it. So I think it's fantastic, and anything that exposure sport is, is obviously a good thing in my eyes. down the way for the torchbearer Stephen Hines, who I'm immensely proud of, as he's raised thousands of pounds for his favourite charity, the Avalon Children's Trust in Fife. Such a proud day to be a torchbearer. atmosphere and it was nice to see all the primaries involved. My wee cousin was singing at it so it was nice to see. Very nice, not, all, not long enough, you know, I really enjoyed it. Yeah. It's good to get all the different skills involved as well. It was really fantastic. Very exciting. Oh, it's spectacular, I enjoyed it. It was, it was cool. awesome, it was cool. Uniquely, we've had a whole day of activities where we started off this morning with the, the National Book Trust, Scottish Book Trust launch, uh, which was fantastic. We had 400 young children uh, participating in that. Yeah, it's a bunch of parents and their children closer into a community. She won't see another one again, so we thought it'd be the, a good idea to bring her down and get involved, you know? Me and different parents hear a bit more of the Olympics. I didn't really feel a part of it before, but I think now, as you say, because it's here and because it's going through other lines so close to us, that it is definitely it's becoming more a part of our, our family and our community, so it's nice. Then we've moved on to the sports event. We've got local primary schools here today experiencing all these sports, and then later on this afternoon we'll have a cultural element because we'll have the choir, uh, 450 uh, residents, young people from across South Lanarkshire participating in the choir as well. So, uh, all dimensions. Make some noise, please! 